Good morning. Good morning, class. Good morning, Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So I will I will be your instructor for the next ten minutes, and my topic is all about gyro compass and gyrotechnic compass. Uh, to start with, let me ask you a question. So, what do you think is the importance why we need to uh, why we need to know the errors of a compass? Anyway, everybody, did everybody uh, see compass yes. here? Yes. Yes, it's very uh, simple too. It's not only used at sea, but it's widely used even on land. So what do you think might be the... Uh, yes, ma'am? Identify the right direction. Yes, to identify uh, the right directions, we need to get the error. What else? What else? Can you think of something else? Deviation, we have to check the deviation of uh, Okay, the uh, deviation, we are now referring to a specific, a specific type of equipment which is, uh, uh, which is, which we use on board. It's the magnetic compass and later on I will explain or you will see on the screen what is the meaning of magnetic compass. Okay? So the intended learning outcome on this topic would be At the end of the session, the students must be able to enumerate various errors affecting magnetic and gyro compass. So we are at, uh, aim to calculate the error, or we don't aim to correct the compass errors or gyro errors. We only aim to enumerate the different kind of errors that is affecting the compass. Okay. <coughs> So we move on to the next slide. Now here principles of a compass. Sir, may I have a volunteer to read? Please. <coughs> sir, yes sir. A magnetic compass is a critical piece of uh, marine navigation equipment. Simply put a magnetized needle freely suspended and it will point towards the magnetic north because of the force caused by the Earth's magnetic field. Thank you very much, sir. So very well said. Uh, this is uh, one uh, type of compass that we use on board. Actually, we, we only use two compass, the gyro and the magnetic compass. Now this is the supplement for the gyro compass, which is the magnetic compass. Magnetic compass, as for the time, my, uh, my subject, is a critical piece of marine navigational equipment. Now, how does uh, magnetic compass work? Magnetic uh, compass work. Sorry. If you you can uh, you can do an experiment. By the way, if you just take a glass and then pour pour a water only half, and then uh, use a needle, and then put it on the, uh, the glass with the water, and just let it uh, let it uh, float there. That is what we we mean by uh, freely suspended. Because this needle, when we put on the water, it is uh, it is affected by the magnetic field of the Earth. So, so the needle points to the magnetic north. So we have uh, two kinds of uh, of uh, direction, which is the true north and the uh, magnetic north. Sir, for those uh, maritime, uh, uh, can I please ask what is the difference between true north and magnetic north? Anybody sir? Uh, sir, yes sir. <coughs> so uh, I would like to, in addition, I would like to explain about uh, the difference that one is uh, that the knowledge uh, is uh, will be corrected from the uh, various errors. As you have mentioned, the giant compass should be uh, corrected by the division error and the variation error. So the division error is the internal uh, errors from the ship, while the variation errors is the outside errors. Geographical errors should be applied, while the division errors is the internal, because the ship is uh, covered by the metal. So uh, 
it will it will be uh, to be collected from the true north that you have mentioned. That is the reason. Okay, sir. Thank you very much. Or it's just simply an explanation for, for the land maritime. Okay. True north is the reference from the map. Actually, everybody has seen the map, right? So, true north will be the true direction on the map. So, whenever you point, uh, I mean, uh, the map, uh, if you see a map, I don't have a picture of the map. So, for example, here is a map. So the direction, the four corners of the earth, this is referring to north, south, west, and east. And it is true. But if we use magnetic compass, then it is referring and it is pointing not to the true north, but to the magnetic north. Okay? Magnetic north is the heading of the compass pointing uh, to the magnetic north. For example, this is the magnetic north, and this is the true north. So if you are here and you, you use a compass, you are pointing to the magnetic north, right? But uh, the problem is, there is an error, and later on we will discuss that. Now. We will move on to the next slide. So now here we will tackle the different types of error present on the magnetic compass. The first one is variation. Sir, can I have a volunteer to read this variation? Yes, ma'am? Variation is caused by the Earth's local magnetic field and produced by electrical currents that originate in the hot liquid outer core of the rotating Earth. Yes, ma'am. Thank you very much. So variation, when we apply apply it for correction to get the true north, <coughs> we need the variation and deviations. And variation, as we define here, is caused by the Earth's local magnetic field and produced by electrical currents that originate in the hot liquid outer core of the rotating Earth. <coughs> so this is the magnetic field, sir. This is the direction or the flow of the magnetic field on the, on the Earth. It's coming from the north. <coughs> so it's from the north going to the south. Okay? So we will move on to the next slide. Okay, deviation. Sir, can I have a volunteer to read, please? <coughs> yes, sir, please. Deviation is caused by magnetic forces within your particular boat. Pieces of metal, such as an engine or an anchor, can cause magnetic forces and also a stereo and other electric equipment or wiring. If too close to the compass, introduce errors in compass setting. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. This is uh, what uh, Captain Joe is talking about. Okay, so we move on to the next slide. So the next is gyro compass. Gyro compass uh, it has three errors, but it's all the minor. Gyro compass can correct correct itself. So when it comes to gyro compass, it is more reliable than magnetic compass. So we will we will see the errors, gyro errors. And as you can see, this there are only three errors. Streaming errors is where a rapid change in course. It is streaming errors. Now, the second one is the speed error, and the third one is latitude error. Okay, and we move on to the next step. So we, we will come on to the conclusions now. Okay, sir, as per the uh, errors that have presented uh, earlier, can we review what is now the, uh, the errors for the magnetic compass? There are two, Variation. only major, major. Uh, Variation. 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 Variation and deviation, correct. Variation. And for the magnetic compass, uh, uh, for the gyro compass, I mean, latitude error. What else, sir? Speed error. And the next one? Streaming error. Thank you very much, sir. So, everybody enumerated the. So, here we go. The variation and deviation. For the gyro compass, we have three. You are all correct. So, this one is the source of. Uh, 
what, what the, all of the items which I presented. Okay.